Hello everyone, and welcome to the weird, scary, and horrible parts of humanity. Today we are looking into a member of the Saudi Arabian royal family who committed murder. The case of Tirki bin Sayyid al-Kabir, who committed murder, which resulted in his execution. Tirki bin Sayyid al-Kabir was the direct descendant of... Abdulaziz ibn Abdul Rahman ibn Faisal ibn Turki ibn Abdullah ibn Muhammad al Sayyid, known in the West as Ibn Sayyid, who was the founder of and commander of the unification of Saudi Arabia under the Third Saudi State in 1934, seeing the unification into what is today the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. Prior to this, Ibn Sayyid was the leader of the Kingdom of Hejaz Najed. Al-Kabir's great-grandfather, Saud Al-Kabir, married Al-Sayyid's sister, Nora bint Abdul Rahman Al-Sayyid. In 2012, Al-Kabir murdered his friend, Adel bin Sulaiman bin Abdul Karim al Muhammad, who he shot to death in a desert camp outside of Riyadh following a fight between the two. Another person was injured. Al-Kabir was arrested by police for the murder of al Muhammad, and when the victim's father refused blood money under Daya, under Sharia law, despite Turki pleading guilty, he was sentenced to death in November 2014. On the 18th of October 2016, Al-Kabir was scheduled to be executed in Riyadh. Desperate, his father offered yet more money under Dia to the father of al muhaimid as a final plea for a stay of execution, who again refused. Awaiting his impending death, Al-Kabir spent time reading the Quran and praying. At 7am, the prison warden took him to write his last will and at 11am, he was taken to the mosque for his final prayer. After Asir prayer at 4.13pm, Al-Kabir was executed allegedly by beheading in public. He was the first member of the Saudi royal family to be executed in nearly 40 years since 1977. When 19-year-old Michal bint Dahud bin Muhammad al Sayyid was executed, we will explore this case in a future video, so don't forget to click that subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified of when that video comes out. The case ironically provoked praise in Saudi Arabia on social media, with many praising the fact that a member of the Saudi royal family was treated as any other member of Saudi society, who, likewise, would have been sentenced to death and executed for murder cases. Saudi Arabia executes hundreds of people every year, with Al-Kabir, the 134th person executed that year in Saudi Arabia. Thank you for watching. Please do yourself a favor and hit that like and subscribe button and the bell icon to inform you when new videos come out. It helps more than you know and your support is truly appreciated. You'll also be seeing two other videos for you to check out. Until next time, stay awesome, stay classy, be kind to everyone you meet, and have an amazing day.